Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I'll show you how to fix SSD not detected while installing Windows 11. Many Windows users have reported that during Windows 11 installation, they are facing error like we could not find any drives. To get a storage driver, click load driver. This error usually appears when installing Windows and means that the installer cannot detect a storage device such as an SSD or HDD. Don't worry, here are some possible reasons and solutions. So let's get started. Number 1. BIOS settings issues. Incorrect settings such as RAID or AHCI mode or disable or enable storage controller. To fix, restart your PC and enter your PC's BIOS by pressing F2, F10, delete or escape. Ensure the storage mode is set correctly. Try switching between AHCI and RAID. and save changes. Now reboot and try Windows installation again. After that, hopefully your problem will be solved. After that, look for VMD controller. Under Advanced, Storage Configuration or Advanced or Main tab. If it hidden, then press Ctrl plus S under this menus. Once you found, just disable it and save changes. Now reboot and try Windows installation again. After that, hopefully your problem will be solved. And don't forget to let us know the result in the comment section. If disable VMD does not work, then re-enable the VMD controller in BIOS and go to next method. Number 2. Missing storage drivers. The installer lacks the necessary drivers for your storage controller. It is common in RAID or NVMe SSDs. To fix, you will need to load storage drivers manually. Download the latest storage Intel RS3 driver from your motherboard or laptop manufacturer website. Copy them to your Windows installation USB drive. During installation, click load driver. After that, browse to the downloaded driver and install it. Note, if your system has RAID enabled, you must keep VMD enabled and load the driver manually. And if you are installing Windows on a single NVMe drive, disable VMD usually works. If you don't know how to perform this operation, then here's a detailed tutorial for you. And don't forget to let us know the result in the comment section. Number 3. Drive not properly connected. Loose or disconnected SATA or PCI cables. Ensure SATA or PCI cables are properly connected and try a different port or cable. Number 4. Very rarely it can occur due to unallocated drive. The drive might be uninitialized or not formatted. To fix, boot into live Windows environment or another PC. Open Disk Management and check if the drive is unallocated. If unallocated, simply create a new partition. Number 5. Corrupt Installation Media Sometimes it can caused by a faulty USB drive or ISO files. In that case, you will need to recreate the Windows installation media using Rufus or the Windows Media Creation Tool and try using a different USB port.
and number 6 if that storage device may be defective. If none of these methods work, try using another PC to check if the drive is detected. Run Crystal Disk Info Tool or similar software to check for drive health. Try these methods, I am sure one of them will definitely help to solve this SSD not detected problem. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share, we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you, thanks for watching, have a nice day.